almost kind of came off for you at the very end there. But uh, up until that point, happy with the effort? Well, I'm ha I was happy. I thought Nick Williams gave us a chance to win. Um, you know, there's a lot of things that go on during a baseball game that, that really a lot of people don't see what kind of magnifies to the end result. And us not doing a good job of playing catch early on bunt plays made Nick Williams throw probably 15 or 20 to 25 extra pitches than he needed to do. And so when you get in the eighth inning and he's up to 120 pitches, you've got to make a decision to get him out of the game where I feel like he was still in pretty good command considering the circumstances of the wetness and all that. I, I'm very proud of how he pitched. And um, so there's a lot of things that lead into that. And, you know, kind of the same old deal. I'm not taking anything away from Vanderbilt. They deserve to win that game. They, they fought hard. But I'm proud of how we fought. After last night, it was a tough loss. We felt we gave some things away. Um, we challenged the team as a, as a staff to come out and, and play hard. And, and, and I thought we did. And the game got away from us. We're a little short at the back end of our pitching. And, and they exploited that in the eighth inning. Ayers played a little bit of a role and had you down two runs um, with two and twos. And what were, the, were those the little things you were talking about yesterday? You need yeah, to we got to take care of the baseball. You know, there's a, to be honest, there were some other plays on the field that I think should have been Ayers. Mm -hmm. That the, the official score was very courteous, uh, uh, gracious to them, and, and uh, um, even that ball hit down the line in the, in the ninth inning that we did, I, I felt uh, should have been in a, in a regular baseball game. But the, it is what it is. That we got to take care of the baseball. We got to take care of the baseball. And and it, what's disappointing for me is, um, and I feel there's a lot of people in the dugout that feel this way, is I feel like we've gotten two good nights of pitching performances, which hasn't happened a lot for us lately, and and we squandered both games. And that's 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 hard to take. To be honest with you. Uh, how much? I don't know did it affect the dugout at all, but Vanderbilt getting two injuries early, um, no, kicks to the face. And no, the and, you know, and, and I, I, I'm really glad that, that uh, he stayed in the game because uh, that you don't ever want to see something like that. And, uh, you know, Nick, we were just trying to go a little middle in. The ball got away from Nick and it, and it hit the young man, and I was, I was very happy for him that he was able to stay in the baseball game. I don't want to ever see anyone get hurt um, on a baseball field. And then the catcher goes down and at the slide at the plate. I don't know what his status is, but that doesn't affect that affects them more than does us. We're we're just trying to play the game no matter who's wearing the uniform on the other side of the field. Okay, nice one. Vincent Jackson's performance tonight and makes two out and catches out there. Um, has some fairly good bat at bat throw it Yeah, he you know, he, Vincent continues to, to grow up just like we see some guys growing up and, and um, we think he's gonna be a very good player and he's starting to show it more consistently for us from the offensive side and the defensive side. Is he Unusual with the amount of speed he brings with his size. Uh, I, don't, I don't know. Yeah, I, I think he's. You know, I wouldn't say he's a burner. I think he's a. He's a good runner. I think he needs to still learn to run the bases a little bit better. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, I wouldn't say he's a burner. He's, I think he's a solid runner for for how tall he is.